Sorry. I don't know. I only haven't read this. Is that no. No, is it? We are building Sarah's design, and this is the place we love to whinge and whine. We are responsible for designing mechanical and electrical, which at times can be very technical. Some of the staff would make you laugh. Here they are, from near and far. We start with James, our monkey. He thinks of himself as being funky. <laughs> he has proved he's no fool after his actions with his woman in Liverpool. We all know what that was, eh, James? Fuck, is the first time I read it, forget half of it. Now, Gibby Dunn was just a st steal from Francie Dan. We have Gibby Dunn. Money's his god, he can't get enough. He's going to the woman and she's dog rough. <laughs> Stephen, and then we go on to Stephen Millen. Stephen Millen is without doubt the villain. For all he can say is <laughs> fucking sick. It's a pity the miserable cunt never buys bums or even a cake. <laughs> when Chris is around, he turns our frowns upside down. For the, for the hats he can wear, always makes Steve swear. These are island house jokes, you know. Ian keeps us all sane. For he is our number one computer peer. For come what may, oh, I can't read that. For come what way, may, he will keep the Trojans at bay. It's just another in house joke. Like, really good. Yarrick is our Polish mate who always starts at eight. <coughs> he would never moan or shout, but he can often act the loud. Our leading lady is that woman, City. For she keeps us all right without ever causing a fight. Then there's John with his big fancy BM car. Just a pity the fucker can never finish below par. <laughs> Fuck. That's one of my bosses right now, almost. Paul Hill has no relation to Milne, but he is our boss, and he, I suppose he always feels that's his loss. And finally, there's me, Jerry Hannigan. The ones in the office always say Hannigan is the man, and if he can't do it, no one can. All in all, we work as one, with the exception, Gabriel Dunn. Jerry, <laughs> Jerry, smile. <laughs>